Have you ever noticed how different types of water can all taste different? There are tons of brands of bottled water. There's tap water, rain water, distilled water, well water, and more. And maybe you even have your own preference on bottled water. So what is it that makes all these waters have different tastes? And how can water that's just sitting in a glass taste different after just a few hours of sitting there? Well, first of all, just plain water, regular H2O with a 7.0 pH, can have a taste. The only time you'll actually drink nearly pure water is if you drink distilled water, though. Water that has been evaporated and then condensed out. Oddly enough, pure water is not necessarily better. Uh, and in fact, most people think it tastes pretty bad, bland, or even kind of flat. Bottled water, well water, and tap water all have dissolved minerals and gases inside of them which give them the variety of tastes. The types of minerals and dissolved gases lead to the wide array of different tastes that we can find. The most common minerals are sodium, calcium, magnesium, potassium, chloride, bicarbonate, and sulfate, and the most common gases are nitrogen, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. So basically, anytime you drink water, you're probably getting a lot more than you thought. So what you should know is that a better tasting water isn't filtered more, it just has your desired amount of different minerals and gases dissolved in it. Now tap water is especially interesting because it also has some extra additives beyond the dissolved gases and minerals. The water treatment plants add in chlorine or chloramine into the water. It's basically bleach. But they add it in such small amounts that it really isn't harmful to people in any way. It is, on the other hand, harmful to bacteria and viruses, so we use it to keep our water safe from pathogens. Fluoride is also added to the water by some water treatment plants, but fluoride is a little bit tricky because there's a variety of different research going both ways. Some say it's good, and some say it's bad. And I really haven't done enough research to make an educated decision on whether or not I think fluoride is beneficial. So what I can say is that from what I've seen, fluoride does seem to help your teeth, but may do minor harm in other ways. Discounting a few areas, tap water is likely just as clean as bottled water, and probably a bajillion times cheaper. So it's kind of up to you on what your preference is. If you prefer a bottled water, feel free. But it definitely does not help the environment, and it's costing you a pretty penny. The last question we need to answer is why water tastes different after it sits out for a few hours. Does it go bad? Well, no, it doesn't go bad in that short amount of time, but it does go through some changes. First, the dissolved chlorine can change into chlorine gas and then just evaporate into the air. Also, the water slowly becomes more carbonated from the CO2 in the air, decreasing its pH and making it taste just a tiny bit different. So hopefully you know more about the water that you drink and why and how it tastes the way it does. If you did learn something, feel free to press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and of course, have a super duper delicious day.